I created a real bully guard on NBA 2K24. Everyone's going low strength. I said, you know what? Let's throw some elbows and go the other way, making him jump in the post, up and under, and one fadeaways. And you know what? Let's just break some ankles as well. Step back Jimmy Butler threes. This build's crazy, man. Breaking ankles in the post right here, then fading away. How disrespectful. And just in case you thought the build could not dribble, well, it definitely can move pretty good. Come back here this way, fade away midi, even making teammates argue with each other. Go let him get it! Yo, you're dog You see my hand in his face, stupid? Shut up! Yo, you look like a milk dud. <laughs> what you gonna do with the thing? <laughs> I was in the builder trying to make something unique, and I definitely did. I genuinely believe this build can be used on the ones court, twos, threes, rec, pro-am, it does not matter. At first, I was like, maybe this is a Kobe build, MJ, something like that, and it actually does have shades of it, but you see, it's an inside the arc scorer. Now, this build right here, is going to blow your mind because when I was in the builder I was trying to make a build with all the cheapest attributes as you guys know post control is cheap mid-range is cheaper than three-pointer and I came up with something that gets Hall of Fame back down Punisher as a six foot seven shooting guard 233 pounds Hall of Fame post fade phenom Hall of Fame post spin technician I mean you name it the build gets some crazy badges Hall of Fame open looks so even though we have a 76 three-pointer, we have badges like we have a way higher three and it's able to make you shoot consistent. Hall of Fame mini magician, Hall of Fame immovable enforcer, which people are saying is better than clamps so far on 2K24. It's a crazy build. It also gets Hall of Fame bulldozer. I'm telling y'all, bro, I don't know what I created, but you see, we also get silver right stick ripper. Okay, we're going to be able to get silver clamps, gold catch and shoot and gold unpluckable due to our 92 post control. And you see silver glove as well. It's a very all around build. It's insane, okay? Because a lot of people do not have high strength on their guards, you know? They're not going to go 80 strength, 90 strength, and this thing is a complete mismatch against the wrong opponent. Even tall centers and things like that, you can still go crazy on because you're way faster than them. So let's hop into some gameplay. This build's gonna be crazy, man. It's gonna blow your guys' minds. First defensive possession in the theater. Yeah, put that down, buddy. I do a tiny little fake like I'm going in. Midi, and that's green. We got gold mini magician at the moment. In some of these gameplays, I don't even have all my badges yet. So just keep in mind what this build can look like with maxed out badges. It's insane, okay? So I'm gonna do a lot of fast forwarding, but zero cuts. You see, I could've went for a mini right there. I'm like, you know what? Let me take this man into the post wide open off that Kobe fade, and I got silver back down Punisher at the moment. But you see, post fade phenom on Hall of Fame. We get silver fast feet. I really made a crazy build due to the fact, really, that you're able to dribble nicely on this game with not that high of a ball handle. You see, off the triple threat snatch back green in this, man. Disgusting, okay? Absolutely disgusting. A movable enforcer popping up. It does not stop what this build is able to do due to the fact, once again, that you're able to get pretty good dribble moves if you know how to dribble with a low ball handle. So we have an 81 ball handle and I think an 80 speed with ball. And you see from the intro right here, behind the back, come back this way, midi, bro. <laughs> People don't expect you to shoot mid-ranges like this build is able to shoot. It's disgusting, bro. I put both of my lethal spots in the midi, and we just do not miss. I'm not sure if I had them in this gameplay right here, but it's nasty. Breaking his ankles. You see, you're able to dribble on this build. There's no doubt about that. Hold on. Check this out. I'm going in. I'm like, ah, uh, layup, easy layup. We do have, I believe, an 87 driving layup, so we're able to get gold fearless finisher on this build i mean it literally does not stop that's what i did i upgraded the literally cheapest attributes possible layup we have a high mid-range instead of a high three-pointer we got 92 post control which is a cheap stat and they all work together beautifully hold on check this out step back like jimmy butler that is jimmy butler's exact animation due to pro play we got silver space creator i mean it doesn't end. It actually doesn't end. So the only thing that I think this build maybe couldn't do at a very high level is run the guard position on the three score. Now you see, I got another wide open midi right here. I don't take it though, cause I just want to mess around. 
literally my defenders are food bro if you guys seen the intro where the teammates were arguing with each other he was like your food your food and it got a lot worse okay i could not put that on youtube because i gotta pay my rent man drop a like and comment down below pay the rent if you want badge Pug to pay his rent i've been working hard for y'all man so this bill right here actually blew my mind i did not expect it at all at first it was supposed to be look i had a layup right there i'm like you know what let me do a post fade i missed okay i'm not cutting that at first it was supposed to be just a like hall of fame post fade phenom i was gonna make a video just about that you know and i was also trying to look in the builder trying to make some cheap attributes work out and it turned into something i actually like playing on you see in the post it's disgusting once you get those in the post by the way as i'll just go ahead and tell you guys i'm not the greatest post player of all time because i've got very little experience in time doing it now like you've seen from the intro i can start doing like the post up and unders like it's disgusting bro what you're able to do out of the dream shake you're able to break ankles and also off the dream shake when you break someone's ankles you get a boost to that so this game's over let's hop into this next game on the two score you see gerbo's gonna drive in i'm wide open easy like i said we have a 76 three-pointer but due to the fact that we have a 92 mid-range we get way better shooting badges than you would normally get into the post easy just like that now in this gameplay i've got gold back down punisher you guys are seeing we're slowly going up i've got gold blinders because blinders pops up a lot on the mid-ranges i take him for a post spin right look at this little guard on me bro Look at this little guard. So once again, I like playing from the right side. I haven't, I've got very little experience playing in the post, but I just want to keep going into the right because that's what I'm good at so far. Look at me throwing this man out of the way into a post spin easy. And like I said, now that I'm learning it more and more, once you got that down, they're going to bite at that. They're going to jump. Then you can go up and under. Then you can do post spins. I mean, it's disgusting. Look at this. I throw him off me into a floater. <laughs> yo bro bro that is literally silver post spin technician i'm literally throwing centers out of the way unless they're very high strength look at this dot off the post spin gerbo's going to miss the shot but you see once you keep breaking them down and breaking them down they don't like that you know obviously they need to start picking up this man's gonna get a wide open shot off the screen and he's going to green his name is patch mellow you know he thinks he's real nice at the game patch q5 their teammates together playing they're going through the screens but you see the gold immovable enforcer the silver pick dodger saying no gerbo gets a little step that's early and we're going to get the ball back wide open for three i mean come on you already know that's money bro you already know that's money at at one point i was shooting like 80 percent on this build on the twos i think i'm at like 70 right now because and look at that bro he reached and got another reach so when he reached i threw the ball because i'm like there's no way he's gonna get another reach and they do so they get the ball back but yeah it's actually disgusting what you're able to do out here bro and look he's gonna try to work his way through this screen but i'm here i am here <laughs> this build actually can do everything now on the threes court you would probably want to use it as like a secondary ball handler because you still do get silver clamps you get silver glove but of course at the most meta possible trying to win as efficiently as possible you probably do want to play with a pure lockdown once again steaming okay steaming my teammate because there's nothing they can do the guard is an absolute isolation if they switch I can just have the center drive in look he's not even playing i'm like i don't want free points i don't want free points i'm a post fade on you but i can just have the center drive in and now the guards on him the little guard they're gonna get a little turnover right there off my teammate throwing a bounce pass but i got silver glove and i'm just gonna fade in his face to end the game i mean back to the 1v1 court this guy was actually pretty good he was moving really solid he does a pump fade goes up takes a shot this gameplay man bro i could probably show you guys 40 minutes of gameplay from playing on this build once again into the midi no one expects it nobody expects it and on top of that we have open looks popping off mini magician popping off 92 mid-range hot spots or lethals depending on where you're at on the court man takes an open shot he misses i'm gonna fast forward because i had no stamina <laughs> you see man the stamina is rough out here when you don't buy gatorade sometimes but straight into the post fade away green just like that i mean it's all day guys your green machine starts going off i mean it does not stop what you're actually able to do on this game and so obviously he gets a blitz right there great steal it would probably be better in ones twos 
and then also you see me getting the chase down as a secondary ball handler in the rec, secondary ball, secondary ball handler in the pro am, maybe even third, like a you know a bailout bucket type of build. I almost get another steal. He's gonna go down and take the layup. So glove is crazy right now i want to i want to make sure you guys understand it's crazy right now 2k might change it so i don't know what it's for sure going to look like in a few months but even silver glove is able to go crazy i'm going down taking my layup it's all about being smart and efficient on this build okay you can play really good and win lots of games consistently but you just have to be smart you see he goes all the way in a circle i'm still there okay still there bro it's nasty he don't even want to guard me i'm pulling up in his face i'm like nah i don't need to open three-pointer i'll just pull up right there on you another glove don't dribble fade away and i'm going to miss the deep midi from the left side so at the moment guys i'll tell you i'm using uh kobe fade over michael jordan i was using michael jordan because it was one that was familiar with last year but i do like the kobe fade a lot better it's just smoother doesn't really have like that nasty hitch to it but obviously some people do like pro 2 as well i'm not even sure if you're able to get yeah i don't think you can get pro 2 on a six foot seven but just in case you guys are wondering yes i am using the kobe fade and okay you can get dribble pro 2 i'm looking through my build right now as we're talking so in my opinion right now it's pro 2 or the kobe fade man the kobe fade is just utter though like really really butter michael jordan is also good though okay so it's really just like what you're good at you see this man's actually good at the game he's saucing up he cooked me right there he did really good i cannot lie he did good but i'm back in the triple threat and i'm unstoppable out here snatch back green it's all about like i said your awareness on the court with this build look at this bro silver glove now obviously you see me pulling up the midi right away this guy's got a decently high ball handle he's a small guard he's got good ball handle and i'm just taking that thing off him bro literally <laughs> did you think that was a bad shot <laughs> did you think that was a bad shot right over this man okay i don't know bro i don't know what i made in the builder but <laughs> it's nasty okay so for game you already know bro you already know i don't want nothing easy i'm gonna post fade get this man out of here if you want to see a 90 game win streak the road record on nba 2k24 click this video right here and i'm out peace